welcome back to my channel in this episode we will be seeing how we can create this kind of glowing effect for our ui and also see how we can, how this can affect our other sprites so let's jump right into it so first of all what we uh, need to check is under our main camera post processing is enabled your canvas is set to world space and your, there is a bloom with a threshold of one this is important if you don't want any other sprites to uh, get a blue uh, bloomy effect and the intensity can be anything between 0 and 1 and minus 0 0.4 so I have another point light uh, these are the settings so this is will this will give a an effect that uh, the glowing is actually affecting nearby sprites so these are and I have this circle a sprite which I have created in gym and this is to just to demonstrate that it can get affected with the point light and Un under a project folder you should uh, you uh, you should have the sprite and it can be any kind of sprite not just circle these are uh, this should uh, these should be set, set these should be the settings you can it can have other settings too but the texture type should be sprite 2d and UI you need to duplicate that sprite and I have this uh, duplicated sprite and it circles one the texture type should be default for this one the filter mode to point and the compression to none then apply it then what you need to do is create this uh, new shader graph uh, which should be the create shader 2d renderer and sprite unlit graph then go to new shader graph like just open it up I have named it as new shader graph and over here into create two new properties one of them i have named main texture and the other one is emission map the main texture should have a reference of uh, main text with a underscore and the emission map should have a reference of underscore emission this should be the exact spelling and then I took the took both of them into our graph. I created a sample texture 2D and for both of them, so emission map also has a sample texture 2D and the main texture also has a sample texture 2D. Take the RGBA from the sample texture uh, from the main texture and uh, add it uh, to a add uh, node. Take any uh, channel from the sample texture 2D from the emission map except the RGBA uh, for like I have taken R and then add it to the B uh, B a value of add and then directly take it to color save the asset go to your scene view and then on whichever UI you want to add you uh, add this glow effect just create a material from this give the main texture uh, the sprite which has a texture type of sprite 2d and ui and give the emission map uh, the sprite which has the texture type of default then select this uh, ui which you want to uh, add the glow effect and then just drag it under the material and you will see that you have this kind of glow effect or uh, even on your game so that's for this video thank you for watching